Sean and Ryan Studios here, and we want to make a video about a topic. And this topic happens to be, does blowing on any ice cartridges really work? So, I read multiple articles. Some say it does work, but it just damages the pins. Other people say it doesn't work, and simply removing it is what gets them to work. So, um, I haven't used this cartridge in a little bit, so let's see if it works. Better not work, then we can actually have this video work. Alright. As you can see, this is happening. I, I don't know what this is, but... Alright. So let's try taking it out. And this car is hard to take out, I don't know why. Alright, let's try taking it out and simply putting it back in. Which is what people say does get it to work. Alright. Nope, that is not the case. Now let's do uh, come on, blowing gosh. on the cartridge test. This thing gets me so annoyed. It, it's the only game that doesn't come out with these. Now, let's blow on it. <sighs> Alright, we blow it on the cartridge and let's see if it works. I don't know if it will or not, but... Mm. Now it Impressive. does work. Can anyone explain Now that? I can finally play Super Mario Bros. Wee. So, that goes to all of you that think it doesn't work. Yes. Explain. We're still not completely sure about this, but we are a little bit. Though we do know that it erodes them over time, so yes, I would recommend trying to take it out and put it back in first thing. Also, pressing the reset button will probably also work. Oh yes, right before we started filming this video, I put in Super Mario Bros. 2 and it didn't work. I reset it twice and it did work. But yes, as you can see, blowing usually works. So, now let's test out a different game. Alright, The Legend of Zelda. This game has given us the most trouble throughout the entire time we've had the system. Oh my god, why didn't this thing come out? I know. It's like in mint condition. It's like brand new. Like, like, look at that in there. I don't know if you can see it, but it looks yeah. brand new. So, it was from GameStop. Oh, alright. Time for Legend of Zelda. Alright, Zelda. This game uh, is mixed. Usually it, it works, but sometimes it doesn't. It used to give us the biggest problem. Oh, that was the controllers. Alright, well, this game is working. This works perfectly, so there's no need to test it. Go ahead. Alright, yeah, my that save has been there forever. Now let's try out... See, the, everything else comes out, but... What other games you got? Uh, Super Mario Bros. 2. Super Mario Bros. 2, okay. I beat this one three times on this system with this cartridge. And I've, I've had this for like a month. I know. Shout out to Stateline Video Games. Best video game store ever. All right. And this one works too, so no need to test it. Now... Alright, we also have a, an unlicensed, illegal, well, I don't know if it's illegal anymore, and, well, it somehow works, uh, 143 in one cartridge. It actually surprisingly has all the full versions of every game. Alright, let's see if this bad boy works. Ooh. Yep, that All right, works. yeah, it does work, alright. Yeah, that works. Alright, so I guess only we got to test on Super Mario Bros, but as you can see, it didn't work, but when we blowed on it, it did work. Now, what if we try out... Remember, we're still not 100% sure, but... What if we try out a different system? Oh, alright. That, the Super Nintendo hasn't given us much problems. The Nintendo 64 has never given us any problems. Sometimes it blacks out on us, but... Super NES can give us some problems. Alright. Okay, here we go. We got this in Super Mario Bros. Duck Hunt. Let's try... I'm not taking it out. I'm wiggling it around. That can... That works, too. Still nothing. Let's try the cartridge blowing. Alright. I'm gonna try to fully take it out and put it back in. See, this is how tests work. Yep, that again. We were very lucky. To Try the blowing. System. See if that works. Right, this is what the test. video's about. Hmm. 
Impressive. It, it worked again. Let's play some Duck Hunt. Coincidence? I mean, I'm gonna try to play Duck Hunt. I don't think so. Doesn't normally work, but... Maybe it will now. Now? Raspberry Pi I had some problems and it just worked over time. Maybe this will fit. Ooh, that scared me. Alright. Now after this... Yeah! We'll try out... The Super NES. This isn't gonna work. Like, someone tell me what's wrong with this TV. Okay. Ah. So, you got the Super NES ready? Yeah. Or, no, not at all. Yeah, and it's a, it's, it's a CRT, so... You got the AV cables plugged in in the back? Yeah, they are. Okay. So, now, let's attempt to take this game out again. There. Uh, we, we went a pretty long time discussing a simple subject. And I think our answer is yes, it does work. So far. And also, though, try resetting it as well. Unless unless it's uh, Zelda or something else with a save battery, then fumbling around with it too much can lead to a loss of save data, which I have learned the hard way, like, three or four times by now. Oh, yeah. Like, one time, I was on Dungeon 6, and it just froze. That was the first problem I had since getting this official NES controller. Let's I'm not, try I'm out a Super NES. I don't know what I did with those other controllers. Remember the ones we made a video about that sucked? Yeah. Yeah. I think I threw them behind a TV or something. Probably. Because we didn't, because we didn't have anything to do okay, with them. Okay, get the Super NES up and running. Alright. While I do that, just... Okay, here's the corn. Just do... Just discuss something. Okay. So yeah, the lighting... Um, we found it pretty poor in the ba our basement, but we used the light we used in our Lego videos, and so now, um, it looks how it does. A lot better. Yeah, so, the it's Super kind of NES, the, cord. the Super NES gives us that in. some problems time to time. Well, it's never even the cartridge, it's like... Okay, what game are we trying to have? Super Mario World? It's the only game we have for it. I'm gonna get Super Mario Kart soon. Okay, I know that. Alright. Yeah, usually it's our AV core that gives us problems. You like have to blow uh, inside there. This is so hard to do and, while filming. And, blow with one hand. and we have to blow inside that, and then it would work. Get, yeah, I can't it. do this with one hand. I couldn't. I tried plugging it in. By the way, this hand. is a Nintendo 64 cord. Like. I don't know how Okay, where's Super Mario thing? World? Yeah, go get that. Uh, Alright, yeah, I think it's all over, over there, so... So, so far, both our tries with Super Mario Rose Duck Hunt not working have resulted in blowing on the cartridge working. So, I'm not understanding why people think it doesn't work. So, so far, I'm on the side of it works. 100%. Okay, so now we're gonna try out Super Mario World for the Super NES and see if that works. All right, we even have this original sleeve. It's, it's amazing. It's amazing what we got for just like a hundred. Right, bucks. you need to change that AV there. All right, then we need to unwrap this controller. Okay, you don't have to unwrap. I, I don't just... think we have to, but John, that's. That's the uh, pure tube. I keep doing that. Alright. It's a blank screen. Now let's see what happens when you blow on the cartridge. This better work. I have good save data on that thing. Oh my gosh, it works. So, Yippee. we're going to say that blowing on your cartridge does work, as you can see from these tests. So, uh, all those YouTubers who think they're so cool really aren't, and people who make videos. Thanks for like, watching, and see you next time. Yeah, I'm all the way over here. I wouldn't want this to go away. Bye.